Hey, what's up guys? It's Del Vinci, and today I'm gonna be breaking down how I produce the beat receipts for Cash Dami and Baby Santana. So this beat is produced by me and Stupid Cool. Stupid Cool is one of the greatest producers of all times. Uh, he's the GOAT. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm gonna dive right into this beat. So um, here's a little, here's how the beat sounds. Okay, so I'm gonna start breaking down the melody. So basically what happened on this beat is I basically made the melody, sent the stupid cool, he did the drums and he arranged the beat. Uh, he put the magic touch on it for sure. But um, the first sound I had here was an Analog Lab 5. Uh, it's just loading right now to open up, but I guess I was using this song, this uh, sound called Bear Band. Bear Band? Um, and these are the chords I played out. This is a nice little like E piano. Uh, the next sound we had was uh, this piano that I played out. And yeah, this is just in the piano version 2 plugin in the Alteria bundle. The next sound we had here is this lead sound in CS80. Called saw lead. Just something pretty simple. And then for the fourth sound here, what I had was this pad. And these are the same chords I used for the electric piano. But when you stack the sounds together, it sounds like this. It's just a lot more fuller of a sound together. Okay, and now I think this is like the main sound of the beat is this sound in Mellotron called Pluck Mood. Um, Yeah, pretty simple, but that that repetitive melody definitely adds a lot of um, body to the melody. And then the last sound here is just a, a string sound in Mellotron called Dream Strings. It's just a sustained note, just to give it, you know, a little bit more feeling. And all together, this is how the melody sounds. Oh. A pretty simple melody, but um, it all comes together very nice. And then for the, that's how the hook is. For the verse, it's just the the pad, the electric piano, and the lead together. Mm -hmm. 
So yeah, that's that's really the majority of the beat, and then the, the last part is just the drums. Pretty simple. You got, you got the tag in the beginning. You got the hi hats, the clap, the um, you know the tags and stuff, and then the 808. But yeah, the drums. You know the classic, super cool drums. Uh, Really, really good oh. drums. <laughs> really amazing plug drums. But yeah, honestly, that's really the whole beat. Uh, this is a pretty simple beat. Uh, a little background about how the song came about is I basically just sent beats to uh, Cash Dami's email. And uh, he hit me up like a couple days later. He was like, bro, I just made a hit to this beat and he played it for me on FaceTime. And I was like, word, that's fine. And then I think, yeah, then he said he got Baby Santana on it, and then he just dropped it on his tape, and yeah, it was super dope, uh, super cool, man, uh, yeah, man, this is, a uh, the breakdown of this beat, I hope you guys enjoy it, I hope you guys watching this could get, uh, some cool knowledge about it, um, yeah, man, I hope, uh, oh, also, shout out my lawyer, Carl, um, I'll put his page up here, he helped me do all the business for this, uh, tape since, uh, or for this song since it was, like, released under, uh, a label and whatnot, and any producer that has a song being put out by a label, definitely always get a lawyer, you know, to do all your paperwork and whatnot, uh, this guy, Carl, I'll definitely hit him up, he's a dope guy, he, he uh, will make sure you get right, uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this, I hope any producers watching this are able to learn something cool about this, appreciate you guys for watching, peace!